In the footage, we see a hallway at the end of which is an open door leading to another room. There doesn't appear to be anyone else in the house, yet when the TikToker turns off the lights, something truly chilling happens. Watch. You see that? Oh yeah. Hello. Hello, please leave. Bye bye. As you can see, a shadowy shape resembling a tall hooded person suddenly appears in the doorway. Yeah, it's time to move. That's that. It's like lights out, but you know, more uh, in the realm of reality. That's a great short. It's an okay movie. I mean, there, again, the skeptic in me will come out and say, hey, you know, maybe it's like just, you know, it's a shadow being cast from a window that you can't really see until the lights are out. Definitely freaky. I'd like to see him walk into the room. Please, show me walking into the room, Mr. TikTok, good sir. I need you to walk down that hallway and confront this shadowy apparition. Otherwise, you're a wuss. Apparently the surveillance system had captured a transparent intruder that made it on the fenced off property, walked through the backyard and was then mysteriously gone after setting off the motion sensors. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh. Mm. It just like comes out, comes out of nowhere, eh? It just sort of like comes into existence. Look how it moves. And this one leaves a trail too, eh? Is that just like a thing of the camera, or...? Oh, that looks like a... I don't even know what that looks like. That looks like, um, <laughs> Dr. Manhattan before he was fully formed. Looks like a screeching, shrieking, pain-experiencing humanoid that just kind of, like, doesn't quite exist in our reality. It's, like, split between two worlds, you know? It's, like, partially dipping its toes into our world. Maybe it's like a 4D creature and it's uh, this is what we can see of it. That's exactly all of it. And then there's something else just totally incomprehensible to any of us going from there. Yeah, that's freaky. Especially because like it sets off all the motion detectors, right? Like it's in this place that's obviously well surveilled and uh, it just it pops in and then pops out. So I'm in the bathroom right now. That is pretty scary. I'm not going to the bathroom if you're wondering. <laughs> Are you but, sure? Uh, I'm hearing like shuffling sounds outside the door. And I need to put the camera on. Bro. Bro, what the f was that? No. That is the most security guard looking security guard I think I've ever seen in my whole entire life. Like if I, if somebody asked me to show them the default security guard, it's this, 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 this guy right here, <laughs> it's gotta be. Boy, I love the reaction when the bang happened. Like his head went back. Like it was like, he snapped his neck going back. He was, he was here, he was all the way back. And he even moved the phone out. It was like, it was cinematic, if anything, it was beautiful. Thank you for that experience, Mr. Default Security Guard. Hello everybody and welcome back to Top 10 Central Dark, your place for all things horror. I'm your host, Keegan Hughes, and today we're taking a look at the top 10 weird videos that will mess with your head. My head is unmess withable, so we'll see where we end up at the end of this, all right? You guys, I'm not so sure where your heads are at, but you let me know, okay? Perfect, let's get into it. What is that? Actually, it's a slow motion. Jim, excuse? What is, is it, a clown? You see that, Mom? Yeah, I see it. What the? Oh, hello. The creeper was standing in front of their house. The it is unknown what that person wanted. Do you notice when they started moving, they were like lagging or something? There was like a, like a trail behind them? Like they left like particle effects on or something? <laughs> I don't know. That was, I didn't know what it was. Not that the guy watching. I thought it was like a clown or something at first. And the guy describes it as the creeper, which, you know, just sends me right back to Minecraft. Um, I don't know. I don't know if that's, uh, that's exactly what we're looking at here. Could be. Nice truck. 
Nice cut. Back to the truck. Somebody's in there, eh? Somebody not great looking. That person not have a face? They don't look like they've got a face. Whoever's looking at the man here appears to have a disformed face. Ah, disformed there are no apparent face. eyes or other facial features. Yeah, I was right. I got there before the narrator did. You see that? My brain's on 110% right now. I took the limitless pill before I started this video. So that's how I saw that the guy had no face before it was time for the narrator to say that he has no face. So. You know, I'm just basically a genius. The world's best at recognizing people in pickup trucks without faces. And nobody else can even step to me when it comes to that category. I suppose I should comment on the, the creepy... <laughs> the creepiness now, as opposed to just how excellent I am at recognizing things. But yeah, that was, um... I mean, it's, it's a nice truck. He's, he's, whipping, he's whipping a pickup. Like, it didn't look like an old beater either. Like, I'm sure whoever's hanging out in there is fine you know so what if they don't have a face they're contributing to the economy they're working hard out there they're just hanging out they got one hour parking they're parked for probably less than an hour homie's just shooting with his camera trying to pick up this guy with no face that's that's an invasion of privacy that's rude for the last several evenings he heard unusual noises stemming from the roof Is that a figure? and tonight it appeared that whatever was causing this was making it into his house sounds strange right he was standing in the hallway when he captured this creature with his cell phone. Oh, that is a creature, eh? What is that? He's like... What is that? Is it like a bagul? Is it... Is it a Shinigami? Is it... Uh, I don't know about that. No, it's not something I would want to see standing at the end of my hallway. No, sir, it's unmoving too. It's confident with its ability to be there. It has no qualms with trespassing in this person's home. It knows that it is the scary thing, not the homeowner. That door just opened on its own. That door just opened on its own? I saw it as well. Oh, it's just that as well. What are you going to do about it? Because I'm not dealing with it. <laughs> Why do I always have to be the one? Like, it's like I'm the sacrificial lamb. Literally? Well, I don't want to have to be the one to deal with it. Oh! <laughs> Not that with itself. Oh my god. Did, did you get that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, hang on. You're going to have to show in the cupboard now. Because people think that this we're like... Oh. Right. Look. Nobody in here. Nobody underneath anything here. <laughs> huh. That was fun, you know, just a, a wholesome little uh, interaction with a ghost. Just open the door, close the door. It, it just seems like a problem that solves itself, you know? They were both so worried about going over and dealing with it, and then the door just shut. Who cares? You know, your door opened and shut. Lainey and Ben, just a couple uh, paranormal Brits living their lives. I wonder if Lucy knows them. Is that true that all, all Brits know each other? Various clips show a large ball of light rocketing Ooh, through the air hello. as a streak of light UFOs. behind it. Meteors. At one point, not far from the horizon, it seems to burst, lighting up a huge Pew. section of the night sky. According to official sources, the meteor didn't cause any damage, but it certainly put on quite a show for those lucky enough to see it. Mm. I mean, thank goodness it <laughs> kind of disintegrated before it hit ground because it could cause a lot of damage. I like to think of it like, uh, you know, it's like a one punch man scenario where this giant meteor is coming down and then it, it was it was Saitama who just whoop, whoop, one hit, one hit done. That's it, right? And just, you know, nobody knew what happened because he's just so low profile at that point. Makes sense, right? Could be aliens, could be aliens like hitting like warp drive or something. Although I don't know why they would warp heading towards Earth. You figured they'd be going around a planet instead of straight towards the, uh, the surface of it if they're gonna be hidden speeds in which cameras cannot pick them up. So maybe it is just a meteor. Maybe it's alien life. Maybe it was somebody um, shooting fireworks down from a drone. The eerie noises fill the air once again. And... Did you just hear that? Screeching. That was f***ing it. That was it? Like Pennywise? Oh. The sounds are both shrill and guttural. Bike revving? They continue for several seconds before the YouTuber wisely decides to leave the area. And <sighs> wise. 
Yeah. Yeah, it's usually a good idea to leave when you see something like that, or I think it was when you hear something like that. That shriek at first, definitely the uh, the peak there. The second one, I'm not really sure what it was, but even if it was like a pig or a, 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 a feral hog, you know, if you don't have a firearm on you, you know, that feral hog could come to your house and they play on the lawn, you know, one to 50 of them could even do it, right? Like to go through that fence, to go over or under or around that fence and walk towards where the noises are being generated. No, don't do it. Good latch. In question, however, something did open that latch, which is not an easy thing to do, at least if nobody is helping. I said it was a good latch, maybe I lied. Maybe I was uh, misinterpreting how quality the latch really was. That's unfortunate. It seemed like a good latch at first. It seemed like it was gonna hold that gate shut, but hey, I don't know. Did a ghost open it or did somebody just not latch it properly? Like I've been guilty of not latching latches properly before and then having them kind of creak open, you know? You, know, you, you slam the door and you assume like, hey, I slammed it, it should be shut. But then it turns out that it like bounced out before the latch could actually like fall down into place. I don't know. And that is all the time we have for today, folks. Those were 10 weird videos that'll mess with your head. Is your head messed with? Mine? Sort of messed with. I thought I was unmess withable, but uh, you know, a couple of those. A couple of those with some uh, freaky apparitions really, uh, you know, got me, got me, got me going. Got my interest peaked. Got me paying attention a little more closely. Make sure you stick around for some bloopers. I'm always saying and doing questionable things. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. <sighs> this cast more shadows? That's a really good question. Pull my hat sideways. I feel like it looks like off kilter. Looks like I'm in a, a music video or something. Hopefully, it doesn't blow up anybody's house. Sure that I picked up just fine. But that one there's like a foot in front of me, but you know, just to be safe. <gasps> Do I have anything else interesting to say about a latch? Not really. Yeah, that's freaky, especially because it like. <sighs> especially because nope, I'm gonna say. <laughs> <sighs> Apologies, we'll just skip that reaction. We'll pretend I just finished watching the video now, ready? Welcome.